Hey YouTubers, uh, back at this Transit Connect and in this video we're just going to fill up the coolant using my favourite method which is the vacuum method. Um, uh, just one thing to bear in mind, make sure when you drain it the heater is in the hot position and also when you fill it, it needs to be in the hot position to open up the valve. Hope you enjoy the video. So there's my basic setup. Shop air, little valve on the expansion tank. I've got this set up already. So we'll open up the valve, let it draw a vacuum. So that's the vacuum. Where are we at? 23. Let's leave that for 10 minutes or so, see if the vacuum holds. So this had about a half hour, that's not moved. So what we do is open the valve for the coolant. And bear in mind, make sure the, the bottom of the, um, the hose always stays in the coolant. the pipes we should start going back to their normal size as the vacuum drops This is my favourite method of uh, filling. Saves bleeding. See the heat of the pipe at the back just expanding back to normal now. Top hose coming back to normal. That's on zero now. Should safely be able to turn that off. We're full there. So the next thing is to run it up. Make sure we've got hot air through the heater. And make sure the fan comes on when it gets to normal operating temperature and check for leaks. So the fan's been on and off. We're up to um, normal operating temperature. Nice hot air through the vents and no leaks. No pressure in the pipes. I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, just bleeding the coolant or refilling the coolant system on the Transit Connect. Uh, I don't know whether I'm going to add this onto the first video or not. I've not done any editing. Um, but I hope you like what I'm doing. Um, if you do, please subscribe, hit the like button, hit the bell to get notified of new videos as and when I publish them, and please leave comments in the box below. 
Uh, with this, I'll probably say to the, well, I will say to the owner that it could do with another flush. Um, and then we go from there. Anyway, thanks for watching.